Hi guys and welcome back. We have one more thing to do before we can start the assault on this Legion outpost. Or we can start it right now, but let's maybe try to stop DD from giving the Legion explosives. We can do that here. We have one injury, but we'll fix that later. Raven will arrive in the village of Ernie in one day and eight hours. So let's go to this area. Five hour travel time. I have reached the destination now. This sector is of interest. We should explore. All right, so we already established control over the Emerald Coast. All right then, let's explore this sector. It is night time, clear weather, and we have intel available. Right, so we found Herman. He is in a bit of trouble though. Right, let's check the map. We have one deployment zone. Danger and explosions. And this is the DD character who is supplying the Legion with explosives. Danger. That's probably something for you, Barry. We have a minefield with Herman in the middle and we have a car crash. Let's check that out first. In attendance. I have spotted a thing that wants an investigate. Pick up the stuff later, just investigate the car crash right now. Okay, Tony, it's your turn to bring the grenades. Carry them by hand, no driving. Pierre. And apparently Tony didn't listen. Mechanics check failed. Smashed beyond repairs, but perhaps there is something useful in this mess. Well, let's uh, grab it. Slide wire here. Some parts, ten parts, and let's actually see if we can further improve the gun Matrix is using. Seeing that we have 68 parts and one lens, so we can install a sniper scope, additional aim level, which will cost an additional IP, I suppose. Prism scope, large, large crit chance bonus for attacks with 3 plus aim levels. It doesn't specify how large a large is. Minor accuracy bonus and if your first action is an attack it counts as being aimed three times. I think this is actually best for the large crit chance bonus. Crit chance right now is one. Let's get a prism scope. Very nice. And anything else here? A few grenades. Very. Get these stick grenades. Ah, well, let's maybe. How can I assist? See how we can help Herman. These guys are actually friendly right now. No problem. Or we can talk to them. I wonder what 
this is. Yeah, pick up the herbs we later. We have agreement. Oh man, you dance like a pregnant warthog. Get those knees up. But I don't understand. I told you what you wanted to know. Yes, you ratted out your friend. Well done. Now I want you to dance in a minefield. If you survive, you get paid. Keep your money. Just let me go. Oh, sweet <laughs> Jesus. I think I stepped on one. I think so too, Herman. So you're in trouble. We can just open fire. Give them a chance to leave. I don't... I suppose they will not do that. And we are basically walking in an ambush. Right, let him go. Perhaps it is not my place to say. But I really think you are being very mean to that man. Who are you? No, don't tell me. I don't care. First we kill you, then this right. right Great! Intruders! Alarm! An ambush. Six I enemies. have a strong dislike against that trap there. Let's see, a goon marauder, two marauders here. I think they have increased hit points. We have one shaped charge. I want to save that for the assault on the outpost. So, stick grenade on these guys. And get into some sort of cover. I got something fresh from the kitchen for all these scots wads. Severely wounded. I feel overwhelmed by the enemy presence around. What can you do? What? Can you hit this, this guy? No problem. Well, slightly out of range. What about I this think guy? I can do this. Friendly fire. <laughs> she may hit Herman, right? Right. <laughs> what is up, man? That's about it. All right, blood. Throw some knives. You will pay for this, but I not. The Lord smiles upon you, brother. Kill this guy. Oh, I have no cover here. Well, he is. Almost dead. It looks like victory will come to us. It but is always more fun <laughs> when it is face to face. <laughs> All right then, blood. Excellent. Maybe hit the deck. No cover available. Ready. Let's take out one of the marauders. Ready to shoot. Oh. All right, and we're done. Only one extra injury, that's decent. 
blood however suppressed by this guy so he needs to die first Presently in attendance. I'll give you a another chance to hit someone maybe from a little Five. bit closer Very good. What? My tricks. Take out this guy. Morale is improving and high. Gotta watch my step around here. Blood still suppressed. Come on, blood! How can you miss that? <laughs> right. Barry. Yeah, grenade is complete overkill. This is in bad shape. I will go present. Very good. I do not know what it is, but we should probably take it just in case we need it. First, though, Barry, do something about the mines, and then we will help Herman, I suppose. I will do. Moving as of this moment. Let's just clear the area of mines. Not sure if Barry stops when he discovers something or that he just runs on the mine. Yes. I will go presently. Moving as of this moment. With certainty. Anything else? I will do. I am in movement. I will go presently. Gives us a nice amount of parts. As of this moment. We have agreement. I have located explosive device. Perhaps I dismantle. Let us see what the Lord in his wisdom has given us. A helmet. Give it to blood. Close combat fighter. Right, cannot do that uh, right now. Right then. I will go presently. Caution. There is a trap here. Yes. We have agreement. Well, let's just use Barry to do the talking. Or maybe let's disarm the mine first. I will do. Yeah, someone with explosive knowledge can disarm it. to go home. My wife Martha would be upset. I'll never hear the end of it. Well, I guess you're right, Herman. That was the impression she gave us when we talked to her. So, what's this all about? The goddamn Lichon! They came into the village, taking what they please. But then that 
idiot Jin has shot at them. They started beating people up and asking questions, so I, I, I told them who did it. I thought hmm. they would just slap him around. How could I know they'd shoot him? Then they brought me here, and I thought I was a goner. Tell us. I wish I could stay and chat, but I really should be getting back to Martha, my wife. Well, good luck with that, Herman. Uh, what about Dee Dee? What about her? Oh no! Don't tell me my wife is all worked up about that wacko again. She gave me a kiss one time when I had to borrow something from the store, and Martha won't ever let me forget it. But it was nothing. I would never get anywhere near her blast radius if you follow me. She's playing crazy, and um, I mean that girl, not my wife. Definitely not my wife. All right then. See you later, Herman. Let's keep this thing about Tine between us, eh? Everyone in town will get the wrong idea. I completely know what you mean. People can be so judgmental. See, I know you don't work for free, but I'll reward you when I'm back at my shop. I'll give you everything I've got. Just please keep my little secret, okay? Well, it's not really a little secret, Herman, but so can't make any promises. Or okay, we won't tell. Well, he got it. <laughs> Apparently, he's giving. A, he's going to give us a lot of stuff. And we are on a mission, so all right, Herman, we won't tell it. Thank you. You've saved my life twice over. Come see me at my shop, and I'll give you everything I have. All right. See you later. Herman snitched on his neighbor Tine, who was then executed by the Legion. Alright. As of this moment. So to the right wrong button. Explosions area. We have agreement. Sent Barry to do the scouting. Moving as of this moment. And disarming. I have found a thing. With certainty. Moving as of this moment. With certainty. Wow. We Lots have of mines. So, plenty of parts for us. Friendly. Moving as of this moment. With certainty. Seems to be clear. Yes. Quickly take a look here. Nothing. Moving as of this moment. Moving toward destination. Yes. Right. So she's completely insane. That's I will go presently. Obvious. Objects of unknown value. Let's get the stuff before she destroys everything. Few parts. I will go presently. Few parts outside. Peacemaker and some ammo. Moving toward destination. Right. Meanwhile, make some room. Probably could scrap these. So let's scrap this. Peacemaker. And let's talk to Dee Dee, I suppose. As of this moment. It worked! See? It worked! Oh, hi, I'm Dee Dee Bombastic. You here to pick up some boom toys? I just sort of uh, blew up the last batch, but I can make some more. 
All right then. Are you okay? Oh, don't worry about me. Explosions are common around here. I put a blast shield under the workbench and I've gotten really good at vaulting over it. Right. Do you sell explosives? Yeah, but I'm low on supplies. <gasps> Bring me parts so I can create some boom toys. I can make the boring types, but also some novel designs. Yeah, give me some novel de designs. I suppose. Well, we know where to find parts. And we need to give her 25. It would be nice to know how many parts we have right now, but alright. Explosives are always useful, so make us some explosives. Oh, is it Christmas already? Thank you! Here, let's trade. Parts for boom toys. I confess. I am curious. I usually order out of catalog. Well, decent. Four stick grenades, one flashbang, and one magazine. Not bad. Tell us. Ah, talk fast. I just set the timer. <laughs> I'm joking. I don't even use timers. <laughs> oh, explosives are so much fun. Right. Ah, we can't ask about the Legion. Right then, why Boombastic? That's what they call me. Well, at least that's what I call myself. That grumpy old guy Bazo calls me a bunch of other names, but half of them I don't even understand. What does whack job mean anyway? At least those Legion boys respect my work. They are very careful and polite around my workshop, and they bring me useful parts for explosives. Hate to break it to you. But your clientele on this island is about to get a whole lot smaller. Right, stop helping the Legion. And this is actually an explosives check. So good thing Barry has a 94. But, but they are nice. They bring me parts to make boom toys. These parts? Very low quality. However, they don't allow me to go near their fort, which is full of wonderful stuff. If you can convince them to let me inside, I'll have enough parts to make boom toys just for myself. You bet. Pinky promise. Alright, explosives check. Successful. Very good. So, what do you think of Basil? He's not a bad person. He just doesn't see things my way. He likes putting things together. I like blowing them up. Why, explosives? Well, it started as a hobby. There's a bunch of old war stuff all along the coast. Uh, Landmines, artillery shells, mortar rounds. I used to play real-life minesweeper with my friends. Until I ran out of friends. Right. So, do you know anything about President Lafontaine? Uh, President who? Sorry, no idea who that is. I hope I haven't blown him up or something. People are so careless in minefields as if they don't have one at home. <laughs> well, Barry may have a minefield at home, not sure. Joke? A sapper walks into a mine. Boom! The mine is disarmed. So is the sapper! <laughs> I get it. I do, unfortunately. Right. Let's say goodbye to Dee Dee. Have a boom boom bastic day. I will go presently. Gained five loyalty to convince Dee Dee to stop helping the Legion. Uh, very good. I am in movement. So now we are. Really ready to assault the strong point outpost because the Legion will no longer receive explosives. Stash of weapons and ammo won't be making its way to the fort, and Bastian's goons won't be helping their Legion friends. Raven will arrive in one day. Let's head back to the village and talk to Herman. Heal some wounds, repair some stuff. No sweat. 
and then we will. There is too much traveling in this job. This is one thing I do not like. So we still have 17 hours, right? Rescued Herman, he promised a reward once he returns to the village and found a machine gun, such as the one requested by Basil. And we found some other stuff, let's quickly check that. Barry can read the magazine. It is always good to learn more and become better. Explosives 95, uh, very good. This is the machine gun. A bunch of locksmith kits. And Barry has 10 stick mines, are very good. Also a flashbang. And let's check the mail real quick. Yeah, some tips. Take a doctor into battle. Trouble in town. Uncle and Luke are fighting again. Looks there will be blood this time. So Basil and Luke are having an argument. Presently in attendance. Apparently. Let's go, yeah. Let's first talk to Herman. Alright, let's talk to Luke. I suppose. You were my friend, Luke. Tine was your friend too. What happened is all your fault. I can see you've already made up your mind, Basil. Nothing I say will change anything. Your goddamn Pierre has become a monster. Yet you still protect him like a baby. And now Tine is dead because of it. You are right, Basil. I have failed both as a father and as a friend. I should have taught my son to... Is that all you can think of, huh? He is not your Pierre. Pierre is a vile gangster. Tine was a good man. And now he is gone and Pierre walked free. And that is why you stand here today with a noose around your neck. All right, then. <laughs> Then do what needs to be done. What are you staring at, Murph? This is village business. It doesn't concern you. So, mob justice, by the looks of it. And I guess whatever we decide, someone will get killed. This action may have major consequences. Well, let's first ask what's going on. Tine, Luke and I, we were best pals. We built this village. Now Tine is dead because of Luke. Tine hated how the Legion was trying to bully us. So, he tried to take out some of Pierre's men hanging around the town, but missed. Luke would do anything for his damn son. He told them who did the shooting and he doesn't even deny it. All right. So he takes the blame on himself, apparently. And that means we are not going to interfere, I suppose. This is none of our business. Even so, I'm sorry you have to see this. I'm sorry any of us have to be here today. Let's get this over with. Goodbye, Luke. May God have mercy on your soul.
Oh, that was kind of harsh. Not sure if you can actually make a better decision. It was none of our business, maybe. Right, let's check the notes first. Herman's re involvement in Tenai's murder was not revealed, and Luke was hanged in the village of Uni. Still not completed, because we still need to talk to Herman, I suppose. Alright. Level up and a bunch of stuff. And he's gone. Right. We'll check out the stuff in the next episode. For now, I'll make a cut here. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one.